My name is Jamie King, and I chair Newmont University's Bachelor's in Software and Game Development degree. Newmont University is a nationally recognized computer science institution founded in 2003. Our goal is to bridge the gap between industry and education via curriculum focused on practical and project-based learning. With over 95% employment, graduates consistently demonstrate proficiency in software development. In the fall of 2011, we started our first cohort of students in the Bachelor's of Software and Game Engineering degree. We developed this degree with input from companies such as Blizzard, Disney, and EA. Many of our courses are developed and taught by professionals who work full-time at some of these companies. Now allow our students to demonstrate what they have been working on since they came to the university. When I came to Newmont, I knew very little about computer science and programming in general, let alone the complex structures found in game engineering. Here at Newmont, we code from the day we enter until the day we graduate. The teachers understand that the most efficient way to transfer knowledge is by providing experiences similar to what we will face after graduation. This is much more effective than sitting through PowerPoint presentation for hours on end. During our time at Newmont, we're building our own personal game engine. This project encompasses a majority of our education. We start with Game Engine Foundations in C++, where we learn the fundamentals such as memory management, pointers, compilation units, and the standard and non-standard libraries. In the introductory C++ course, we constructed a math library. Through its development, we literally put our hands on vector operations, affine transformations, calculus, and other core game mathematics. We visually gain experience with the math in addition to working it out on paper. Dot products at this point are like second nature. We also use test-driven development while creating our math library. We write a test ensuring that it fails, and then implement the code necessary to make sure it succeeds. All the while, we commit our code to source control, maintaining a history of our progress. In addition, the instructors use this system to grade our code, ensuring that it executes in multiple environments. Throughout our time at Newmont, we build tools such as a profiler, an error tracking system, a logging system, and a memory leak and heat corruption detection tool. We understand that computers store bytes, and that abstract C++ data types simply exist to accelerate our productivity. From there, we move into our first graphics course, where we build a rendering system using OpenGL. Eventually, we're going to add DirectX abstraction to this. This subsystem handles geometry management, instance management, and vertex and fragment shaders. We also write several shaders producing attractive effects, such as fundamental lighting equations, texturing, and particle effects. We also build a debug shape and debug menu tool. We use these instruments during the development of our own games. My name is Paul Johnston and I work in the game industry. With Jamie, I designed and taught one of Newmont's core C++ game engineering courses. As mentioned earlier, we created an experience where students built core game engine constructs. This was challenging for both us and the students, but for the students that applied themselves, it was truly rewarding. I'm confident that graduates will quickly contribute to their future employers' needs. My name is Lara Parson, and I am the University Relations Director at Newmont University. We are currently planning our internship program called Enterprise Projects. Those internships will begin in January of 2014, and we are looking for companies interested in partnering with us. If you are interested in learning more about an enterprise project or hiring our graduates, please contact me.